Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for October 3rd of 2024 is titled Eclipse at Sunrise. So what do we see here? Well, here we see the rising sun off in the distance with some clouds there. And we can see that the sun does not look its normal shape. And that is because the moon happens to be blocking a portion of the sun there. Sun there. So the moon is blocking that upper portion, giving the sun actually a crescent shape in appearance. And this is because of the eclipse that occurred on October 2nd of this year. That was visible over parts of the Pacific and Atlantic oceans. So we could see if you were in the right location, you would be able to see what is called an annular eclipse. Now an annular eclipse occurs when you get an eclipse, but the moon is a little bit farther away in its orbit. So it does not appear quite large enough to completely block out the sun. And that leaves at the total phase of the eclipse, a ring of fire around the moon's limb. So you can still see portions of the sun because the moon was just not quite large enough to block it out. So that differs from a total eclipse, a total completely total eclipse, the moon would be a little bit closer, it completely blocks out the sun and the sun will disappear. And in that case, you would see the material around it, you would be seeing the atmosphere of the sun, not the surface of, of the sun itself. So here we have an image taken in Hawaii out in the Pacific, which was a region that saw a partial eclipse. You had to be a lot farther south in order to see the total eclipse, which actually went through uh, the uh, parts of the Pacific Ocean, very southern tip of South America, and then into the Atlantic. So not many places on land got to see the t annular eclipse that occurred. But many areas around, such as here in Hawaii and other places in South America, would have been able to see a partial eclipse such as the one pictured here. Now eclipses occur in seasons about six months apart. So six months ago we had another eclipse and that was the total solar eclipse that went across much uh, parts of North America. So eclipses will occur about every six months and that is just the eclipse seasons when the moon, sun and earth all line up at those two specific points giving us the possibility for an eclipse because the other thing you need is you need the moon to be in the right position meaning that you need to have a new moon in order to be seeing a solar eclipse where the moon will pass in front of the sun or you need to have a full moon in order to have a lunar eclipse that will mean the moon is passing into Earth's shadow. And either of those that occur very close to those time frames, to those eclipse seasons, especially at the central portion of that eclipse season, will give us the best and longest lasting eclipses. So that was our picture of the day for October 3rd of 2024. It was titled Eclipse at Sunrise. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be Comet at Moonrise. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.